packaging of a DNA helix. In this module, you will learn how DNA is packaged inside the nucleus of a cell. DNA or deoxyribonucleic acid is a highly coiled structure present within the ultramicroscopic nucleus of a cell. If you fully stretch the DNA of a cell, you will find its length to be nearly 1.7 meters. Before we find out how DNA is packaged inside the nucleus of a cell, let us first learn about a few structures that help in DNA packaging. Nucleosome This is a bead-like structure consisting of histone proteins and DNA. Histone proteins These are basic proteins that form a skeleton around which DNA is wrapped. These are of two types. Co-histone proteins This is made of four proteins and finally forms an octama. Linker histone protein This is made of a single protein. Solenoid This is a rod-like structure consisting of five to seven nucleosomes that coil around one another. Let us now see how DNA is packaged. The nucleus of a cell, as you know, contains DNA in the form of a loose thread-like structure called chromatin. Chromatin is a fiber or a string with beads or nucleosomes that are arranged at some distance from one another. You can call this structure beads on a string which has a diameter of about 10 nanometers. Let us now find out more about these beads or nucleosomes. The proteins that actually form the nucleosomes are further of two types, core histone protein and linker histone proteins. The core histone proteins form an optima assembly of nucleosomes. The optima contains two copies each of the four proteins H2A, H2B, H3 and H4. This configuration of histone proteins is called the core of nucleosomes. A linker histone made of H1 protein is attached to the side of the nucleosome core at the entry and exit of DNA. It stabilizes the coiling of DNA during packaging. In this module you have learned DNA is present inside the nucleus of a cell. DNA coils around the histone proteins and forms 10 nanometers thick fibers called nucleosomes. The nucleosomes further coil to form fibers with a diameter of 30 nanometers called solenoids which fit into the nucleus of a cell.